The Wright State baseball team has enjoyed plenty of success in recent years, but this year there's something different. And it's not that they clinched the conference championship with two weeks left in the season, or even that the Raiders have a new head coach. Although Greg Lovelady did implement the change after moving up from assistant to head coach this season, but he has his team doing yoga after practice. Now, since the guys do yoga without their shirts on, Coach Lovelady asked me not to film it, but the dividends, they're showing up on the field, even though it's a bit of a tough sell to guys to do yoga at first. No, we're not ashamed about it, but every day we got to get a yoga, you know, we take a little bit longer to get there than we should. And when you say yoga, most people think uh, yoga pants and tight shirts and, you know, we got a bunch of guys out there doing yoga together. I think everyone enjoys it. They get the tan with their shirts off. It's not easy. And so I think that maybe the first couple of times the guys went in thinking, oh, great, I can't believe we're doing yoga. But once they got done and they were like, you know, geez, like that wasn't easy. That was really difficult. Yoga is mainly for the pitchers, but it seems to have increased the flexibility of the players, and the Raiders are hoping it will get them to the NCAA tournament for the first time since 2011.